Hello everyone, Taylor here, and I recently did a reaction to the first Red Sparrow trailer that came out a couple of months ago. There is a new trailer that just dropped yesterday, I think it was, so I'm going to check that out. I loved the first trailer, and I said that this looks like the Black Widow movie that we all have been wanting, except we're getting Jennifer Lawrence instead of Scarlett Johansson. Well, let's check this out. I'm really, really excited to see this. Morning, Mama. What is it? I have to go away for a while. I was told to take a man to a hotel. They said he was an enemy of the state. Take off your dress. In an exchange, my mother would get the doctor she needed. Instead, they cut his throat. There could be no witnesses. So, they gave me a choice. Die, or become a sparrow. From this day forward, you will become sparrows. Weapons in a global struggle for power. You'll be trained in psychological manipulation. You must learn to push yourself beyond all limitation. Take off your clothes. When we are finished with you, the person you were will no longer exist. Every human being is a puzzle of need. You must become the missing piece, and they will tell you anything. You have a gift. You know how to survive. This is what you were meant to do. There is a traitor in the government. His last known contact is an American. Get close to him. I thought I saw you in the pool yesterday. Are we going to become friends? Is that what you want? <sighs> I like this. She's a sparrow. You only matter because of what you can do for them. Work with me and make these men pay. You are better at this than any of us. Your only problem is you have a soul. We can't trust a word that comes out of her mouth. There's something else we're not seeing. If she's compromised, she will be eliminated. What have you done? Oh, You belong to them. They'll never let you go. I'll find a way. Yes! Oh, it looks so good! So, for me, Jennifer Lawrence can be kind of hit or miss. Um, sometimes she really puts a lot into her movies and she's very talented and I really enjoy the work she does. This movie looks like it's going to be one of those movies. And I'm so, so excited because movies like this, I don't care how many they make where it's a female who's a badass spy or a badass assassin or a kid, like whatever it is, just all of these movies, I want them. So I'm very excited for this. It really looks like it's going to be full of crazy action and sexy Jennifer Lawrence, which, I mean, yes, okay. Um, and I don't know, I just, I really am digging this. I really, really actually do want to see this now because her and Joel Edgerton and Jeremy Irons, that cast is fantastic. And I'm a little bit obsessed with Russia. I always have been since I was a little kid. I don't know why. So the whole Russian spy thing makes me happy. Like I said, it's probably as close to an actual Black Widow movie that we're gonna get, at least for now. I really do hope that we keep getting more movies like this because women are just so badass. Like, men are too, obviously, because we've gotten the James Bourne and the James Bond and the... Did I just say James Bourne? Jason Bourne? Close enough. Um, and all those kinds of movies. And so getting these kind of movies just make me feel so great. And you know, sometimes I just want to feel great. Sometimes I want to feel like it's realistic for me to be like, yeah, I can be an assassin or a Russian spy or whatever it is. And you know, I just, that's good. I like those kind of things. And I feel like all women should be able to feel that way. 
especially little girls like I don't know if this is appropriate for little girls maybe not I don't know <laughs> but but things like this where they get to see women being strong and powerful and not taking crap from anybody and and even though you know she is a victim in this movie and and she has people controlling her and things like that she's she's still you know from what it seems like she's still trying to control her own thing she's like I'm gonna find my way out of this I'm a badass now I have all these skills like I don't know and I just feel like it's a very honest story too where she feels a little powerless all she wants to do is help her mom and now she's in this crazy situation where people are using her for her body and her skills and her mind and she's just basically a pawn in this whole thing and she's still trying to find you know what she can do about it and where she's gonna go and how she's gonna live with it and live in it and and I love that I think it's so great and I really really hope that her character ends up being very very complex I hope it's just not a story that kind of stays on the surface level and we actually get to really dive into her character and how she feels and why she makes the decisions that she makes and things like that so um yeah, I, I'm really, really excited for this, guys. I seriously love this. I love it already, so I'm really, really hoping that it's a good movie. Please let me know what you guys think in the comments. I'd love to talk to you all about this. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please hit that like button down there if you enjoyed your time here. Also down there are all of my social media links as well as my Patreon campaign link. And yeah. I think that's all I've got for you this time. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you all next time.